Oh, there's a thing here I didn't see before. Oh, hi there. Hi, Jules. and my work and now he's scared of being plagiarized oh that is really fucking rich jules oh and he's reportedly misplaced the manuscript pages i need for my work suddenly the exact pages that i need to reference have just vanished he is actively impeding critical bureau research i mean if he can do that then what is stopping me from going down to that lab? And, and I don't know, just inverting the amplifiers or misaligning the receivers or both. It's the same thing in principle. Uh-oh. One evil does not excuse another. He booked the lab. Some big experiment tomorrow. I can't find the details anywhere. Is hiding them. All those years he steals credit from my ideas and my work, and now he's scared of being plagiarized? Oh, that is really fucking rich, Jules. Wait for me to turn this off. Oh, and he's reportedly misplaced the manuscript pages okay. I need for my work. Suddenly, I need the to read pages these. That I need to reference have just vanished. <laughs> He is actively impeding critical bureau research. Maybe if I go out the other side. I mean, if he can do that, then what is I need that. I need that to stop so I can read this note. Or misaligning the receivers or both. Okay, anyways. Um, I couldn't stop thinking about this new, these new direction lake house after I got back to New York. Pivoting research threshold redacted reality manipulation effect is too much of a shock for you. It didn't seem to... Okay, hold on. Can I turn off voices? They, they've done this a few times in the game where we're, when we're trying to do something... Um, that there's something else going on and it makes it hard to read stuff. Uh, it seemed like your work on containment was stalling, so I decided that you could all use a fresh start. Here's something to get you started. Some of the drawings made by a certain redacted a while back, 6D001 and 6D004, found in the attached envelope. Test for the reaction may trigger the shadow. Still don't like the unscientific that name is. Designate the artist as P6 in your records. I expect regular updates, darling. Okay, there's a tree. Okay, let's turn the voice back up. But yeah, I I really wish they had, oh, no, not not to one twenty, Jesus. I really wish they had a way to like stop yeah, and I don't know, things just like this. The amplifiers or misaligning the receivers or both. It's the same thing in principle. Because it it, it makes a light it... switch cord. Oh yeah, we're not gonna pull that. He booked the lab. Some big experiment tomorrow. Quick lesson on light switch I can't boards. find the details If you anywhere. find one, pull it three times. Yep, them. I remember that from the control DLC. All those years, he steals credit from my ideas and my work, and now he's scared of being plagiarized. Oh, that is Blue. Really fucking rich Green. Tools. And look where we are. The Ocean View Motel is a dimensional yep. intersection. The doors from the lobby can lead anywhere. This but I remember from the control I didn't DLC. End up in the lobby this time, which was definitely unusual. So th this happens in control. There's a place where you you pull a light switch and then you end up here. I think I don't know if it's in the Alan Wake DLC or if it's just in control, but this definitely happens there. Okay. Interesting. Panopticon? But the Panopticon is it? Is it? Yeah, but we'll say at the oldest house. P6. No! Oh, 
Wait. Isn't this... Oh, I don't want to spoil Control, but this this character, I think, is important to Control's story. Estevez, Federal Bureau of Control. Identify yourself. I'm... It's quiet. Who are you? It's been a long time since I've seen anyone. How do you get fed, though? This is an FBC containment unit. Why is the Bureau detaining you? I'm where I belong. Everyone I meet here is either a painting or a paracriminal. There's a sign over there for the Panopticon. The Panopticon's only in New York, in HQ. Is this the oldest house? I think that's where I am. So you are inside the oldest house. Is anyone else alive? I Interesting. Can't. State can't escape. So there's there's a lot of talking. It said home, not here, there. Hey, this is important. FBC headquarters went dark four years ago. Four years what ago? What happened in there? We were attacked. Trapped, free, dreaming, suffocating. No. no not again. Not again. Not Remember yet. too much. No. 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 Stay with me. Stay with me. Okay. 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 Attacked by what? what? Attacked the oldest house. I need to know. Something's changing. Outside. Can you feel it? I can hear it. It's getting worse. You can't stay, can you? Hold on. That's so well I need to know if I can... Tell Jesse I tried. I really did. Yep, okay. I'm not gonna spoil who that is, but this character is important to control. Oh no, is this our preview of Control 2? Because, oh no. <laughs> Looks like they just... Murderer and victim. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Alright, I, I think... Uh, I've all but announced it. Just so everyone's aware. Uh, once we get done with our Clock Tower series playthrough... Uh, at, in the beginning of November, Mondays is going to be Remedy Game Day. We're going to do Max Payne 1, Max Payne 2, Quantum Break, and Control. Um, just because I've never played Quantum Break, I've never played Max Payne 2, it's been... I haven't played Max Payne 1 since release. Um, and Control, I played on release and then after they released the DLC, but I'll be honest, I don't remember a whole lot about it. I remember bits and pieces. I think I know who that is. And he's very important to control, so I don't want to spoil it, but we are going to do a playthrough of of all of those, just just so we can get a little bit of a refresher and stuff. So look forward to that in November. All right. Time to go down to five. So that, yeah, that, it seems like that floor was completely just about lore and and talking about the universe and stuff. So we, we now know about a Samantha. We know about Control 2, potentially got some information there. We, we... Oh, Jesus. Did the elevator just, no, okay. Let the elevator flop. One, two, three. Sub level five. All right. But, uh, hold on. I gotta check on one more thing. I was checking something on my phone when, uh, 
Threshold experiment. Oh no. That's the wall. The wall they cut out of his cell that he painted in his own blood with. And they put it over the lake. Had opened the door into Cauldron Lake's threshold. Yeah. It was forced. It was unstable. Shutting the experiment down was the only option. Yeah, it's not going to be that easy. You got two marmonts at. Yeah, I was say you got two marmonts as taken right now. Just take out tools. Indeed. Yeah, I figured Diana was gonna be because remember we saw Diana first before we ever saw Jules with the Dark Crescent. We saw Scratch, and then we saw Diana right next to each other. Well, that's, uh, intense. Oh, and it's Black Rock, too. Superman punch me. Hey, Roman Reigns, chill down. So what are you talking about? More problems. We got painting guys down here? What's going on? Oh, we do. Okay. See our skeleton, isn't that fun? Jesus Christ. She really only have one more shot on her. Alright, pull the switch. Get out of there, rest of us.
To hell with this. You're angry, I get this. I was wondering if we got more stuff out of that by talking. Oh yeah, she's gonna get like a vision because of the th she's near a threshold. Remember, we saw these with Saga. The question, the question is: is who does she see? Agent Estevez stood in the forest just ah, wait. She watched her team detain Alan Wake and Ilmo Cosmo, stuffing them into black SUVs. She realized this was the moment Wake had been writing in the vision she had seen. The story was coming true. She pushed the thought out of her head. It had been a good tip, a way to find Wake. Nothing more. Alan Wake! How did he get out? After the threshold event collapsed, I was back at Cauldron Lake. But for a moment, I was somewhere else. He was in the the I diner. I knew I remembered Booker. He was, writing he was in the diner. Him in Bright Falls, in the woods. It was a good tip. I called the surviving members of my team and I told them to meet me there. You know, these cases. They never get less ambiguous or easier. They swap those around. This one. Subtitles. This, this was tough. Because protocol says entities like the Taken are monsters, threats. But the Marmots were monsters way before the shadow got to them. There it is. So at the end of the day, what's the difference? Mmm. End of end of chapter? Wait, there's more than one chapter to this? Or does that just mean the end of the DLC chapter? Hold on, let's see. Deep breaths, deep breaths. I think that's the end of the DLC. Okay, that is the end of the DLC. Also, did you hear it said deep breaths? Clock stopped. And another shoe was dropped. What a mess. Wow. That was crazy, dude. That was an amazing DLC. And we got so many tidbits on what we can expect from not only Control 2, but maybe from the universe at large. Right? So... Yeah, man, that's crazy. That was a good DLC. Uh, now, I will say probably 45 minutes of that was us just reading the blog post um there is that other website that you can apparently give your email to it's called sirens uh, or it has sirens on it so i don't know if that's like a, a a tip for like getting information on control or something but uh so there's another website you can interact with but um i'm not gonna just randomly put my uh email and stuff on stream for that website you know <laughs> But uh, control franchise director. There we go. Um, but uh, man, that was a really good DLC. Um, I kind of like I said, I kind of figured that Diana was going to be the boss because we saw at the very beginning when we first enter the lake house, we don't see Jules's face. We see Scratch's face and we see Diana's face. It wasn't till later on that we saw Jules's face. 
feels like my heart also that's a that's a pretty good song but there you go that was the Alan Wake Lake House DLC. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I know I did. That was that was great. I'm very excited for what whatever's coming next. Um, Rem Remedy has been doing at least with with Alan Wake Two has done an excellent job in storytelling, both subtly and like overtly. And I just, I think there's just so much to talk about from like the concepts that are that are established in this game to what's what the universe is getting established. It's just, it's just really cool. I think it's really, really cool. I think, I think what I, when like, I don't think it'd be fair to set other uh, like indie studios up to like this standard. These, these people have been doing development for a while now. And I think they've, I think with this game and, and Control, because I remember really enjo enjoying Control, I think they finally start to hit their stride. Um, from a storytelling standpoint, from an aesthetic standpoint, just, just overall design and stuff. Um, and uh, I'm, I'm so excited for Control 2. I'm excited to see what the remake of Max Payne looks like. It's just we we've remedy is is really really good again if they could just fix the the optimization issues between now and the release or fix them more you know for this so more people can play it um, but now but specifically between now and the release of Control Two I think I would have zero complaints uh, uh, about this game but uh, if you enjoyed that do do not forget to subscribe I do appreciate you guys over there watching on YouTube and I will see you all next playthrough.